This time, I will get my divorce. Mr. Chapter 1 A Husband's Indifference December had just begun, and it was colder than ever before. Sonia Reed was lying on the sofa blankly, listening to the screams of her mother-in-law, Jean White, coming from downstairs. Sonia Reed, it s one thing if you can't give birth to a child now. You've even started to not cook on time. Are you trying to starve me and Tyler to death? In the six years that she was married to Toby Fuller, her mother-in-law had always complained that she was a hen that could not lay eggs. However, no one had stopped to think that her husband had never touched her since the beginning of their marriage. Quickly come down and help me organize my school bag. I still have to go to school. For God's sake. A teenager urged. Tyler was Toby's younger brother. He was simply the devil's spawn. Ever since Sonia married into this family, he had been finding different ways to torture her each day. In his opinion, this sister-in-law that his brother married was an easy target. Upon hearing that, Sonia went downstairs, entered the kitchen to cook, and then sorted out Tyler's school bag and lunch boxes like a robot. Mom, food is ready. Jean got angry as soon as she saw Sonia's emotionless look. Immediately, she slammed the glass of water on the table and said, Gee, Sonia, you raise spending my son as money and living in his house. So how dare you wear this scornful expression? Believe it or not, I will call Toby immediately and ask him to divorce you right away. Sonia's hand which was holding the dinner plate shook. She then took a deep breath and forced a smile. Mom, I am not scornful. Jean didn't buy it, and instead said in a strange manner, Sonia, don't think that just because you have the old woman as support, your place as Mistress Fuller is guaranteed. After all, you are nothing in front of Tina. Sonia turned pale when she heard the woman's name. Tyler saw how the situation unfolded with his own two eyes. Immediately, he grinned and said, Dante, you know. Tina is about to be discharged from the hospital. My brother is going to bring her home to live with us. Sonia's eyelids twitched, and the hands that she de used to rearrange the plates trembled once more. Jean couldn't bear to look at Sonia as fake grievances, so she snorted coldly and waved at her dismissively. Dante, stand in front of me. You ray ruining my appetite. Get out of here. Sonia, too didn't want to stay there any longer, so she walked upstairs and sat back onto the sofa. In the evening, a Maybach stopped at the door. Noticing that, Sonia immediately got up from the sofa and trotted to the balcony to look down. A slender man in a suit got out of the car. He had a handsome face and outstanding temperament. He looked even better than some of the celebrities on TV. The man seemed to notice that someone was looking at him. So he looked up to see Sonia. His eyes were cold and merciless. However, Sonia had long accustomed to this look, and the corners of her mouth twitched without a hint of a smile. After Toby entered the room, Sonia ran the water in the bathtub for him to bathe as usual. Honey, Grandma has been to the temple for almost a month. In the afternoon, she called and said she is praying for your safety. I have something to tell you. Toby stopped Sonia, who was busy preparing his bath. Hearing that, Sonia looked back. Toby only stared at her with his dark eyes. There was indifference and alienation in them never any warmth. He moved his thin lips and said in a deep voice, Tina is coming back, so you will move out tomorrow. Sonia's heart turned to ice, inch by inch. Surely enough, Tyler was right. What if I refused to? Her voice was soft, like a cloud of misty smoke. Toby frowned as soon as he heard what she said. This was the first time this obedient woman ever disobeyed him. His voice was cold as he uttered. Dante forget how you even got married to me six years ago. How could she forget? When Tina had a car accident, she was the one that called the ambulance and even periodically transfused her rare blood to Tina. With that... Toby was grateful to her and promised her that he would grant her a request. At that time, Sonia said that her only request was to marry him. 
That was a thought that had been deeply rooted in her ever since the first time she saw Toby in high school. Welcome to download Flipread app to read more chapters of this time. I will get my divorce. Mr. Novel Online.